start the assembling, put down your GPR like shown, the rear and front antenna, the telescopic arms and in the middle the main unit. The next step is to gently press the telescopic arms into the openings and like you can see there is a silver button that is facing upwards and needs to be clicked. Now we connect the Bose antenna connectors to the main unit by just slip it over the two pins and turn it around. Now we slide the opening from the telescopic arms into the quick release and tighten them up. We do this on both arms and the QSM. As shown, the main unit isn't high enough to grab by hand, so we need to adjust the height of the machine by just turning the clamp holders, adjust the lengths and the QSM again so they don't can fall out or slip out. Now we replicate the steps on the other side, adjust the length equally. As you can see now, the main unit is way higher than before and we barely can touch the handlebar of the main unit. Now we double check by lifting up the radar and it seems to be perfect. Now we can start to turn the cables around the shaft and connect the main unit with the antennas. We repeat the steps from before on the rear antenna, we line up the cable, plug in the connector and secure him. Now just put in your laptop into the middle holder, the magnets will snap in and you are set to go. To disassemble the GPR, we just need to disconnect all our connectors, reverse side like before. Next step is to open the quick release, slide out the telescopic antenna arms on both sides. To separate the telescopic arms from the main unit, you need to know that you need to press this little silver button to loosen the connector and then you can pull it out. Now just open the clamps from the telescopic arms, put it to its original length, secure it again so they won't fall out and stay fit and tight. If you want to recharge your antenna arms, you just need the AC connectors, the arrow needs to be up, near the silver button, you press it in and they stay secured. Repeat this on the other side, arrow up, silver button up, click in and wait till the lights go on, so now it's charging. Simply wait till the lights goes off. Then you know your battery is fully charged and you can use your OKM GPR again on the field.